Hey everybody, how you doing? My name is Dave. I'm here to show you a quick tutorial on how to disable the seatbelt chime on a 2014 Dodge Dart. Uh, I'm a person that particularly doesn't like to wear my seatbelt too often um, because uh, to me it's just uncomfortable. I know that's bad to say, but uh, there's times out there where people might want to not wear a seatbelt because they're wearing a button-down shirt with a tie or something and they're afraid of getting their clothes wrinkled up. So this is pre uh, pretty easy. Um, I'm just going to explain the instructions real quick and then I'll actually perform it for you. Uh, this is, like I said, a 2014 Dodge Dart. I'm assuming this, this tutorial can work in other Chrysler uh, vehicles. Uh, you can give it a shot, but I can't guarantee you it will work. Uh, all I know is this uh, works particularly with this car. So first of all, what you want to do is you want to... Um, have the car in the off position, then go ahead and fasten your seatbelt in so it's locked in with the car off. Now what you want to do is you want to go and put the key into the run position so the dash lights up, uh, but don't start it. You will see the seatbelt light come on on the top. You want to wait for that light to shut off. After that, you have 60 seconds to unclick and then click the seatbelt three times, and at the end of the third time, the seatbelt has to stay in the locked position. After that, you'll turn the key off, and you will hear a chime. So I'm still in the middle of that 60 seconds. I'll just go ahead and unclick and click the seatbelt three times. One, two, three, and shut the car off, and you'll hear a chime. Now you have disabled the seatbelt chime. It will no longer beep when you're going down the road.